we're Joshua and Ikumi, traveling and living around the world happily together since 2019. <laughs> since the pandemic, sometimes COVID regulations come in between us. We were separated once in Turkey and Georgia, and again, Bye, my husband. now Ikumi is in Japan and I'm still in Georgia. Ikumi just arrived in Japan and is starting a 15 night quarantine. So like and subscribe as we travel without expectations. Good morning ninjas. Quarantine day one in Chiba near Narita Airport. I slept well. I still have the jet lag of course. I couldn't really go to sleep until like 2 a.m. But I woke up all right with this nice weather. Blue sky, no clouds at all. It's not that cold compared to Georgia. This is much nicer here. Uh, it took five hours for us to come out of the airport from the time that we got off the aircraft. That was insane. I was not allowed to film the whole time, so I didn't have any footage. But basically, until you are proven negative, they'll just put you in the seat. Anyways, so this is my quarantine day one. And I do need to get out for grocery shopping. Otherwise, I have nothing to eat. So yeah, I'm going to do that and make sure I have enough that I don't have to get out of this house for another at least couple of days. Okay, so I just came back from a grocery shopping. This for 80 USD. And this probably lasts five days if I cook well. And you know I do. This is $3 discount from the price. Yeah, this is 30 cents discount tofu this also 30 cents discount two slices of yellowtail that's basically like four dollars 4.43 but damn 80 bucks everybody so expensive to live in japan hey babe hey hi how are you? I'm good. Nice to see you, babe. Yeah. yeah, it's good to see you too. That you made it there safe. How was the flight? It was long. I mean, flight was okay, but yeah. it's just after I got off the airplane, PCR and waiting time was just too long. Yeah, it's definitely really hard to move around mm. right now, you know? Yeah. But everything else is good. Cool. Quarantine. Yeah, the, the room is nice. I like the room. I mean, it's damn, it's five times more expensive than what we usually pay for. So, yeah, it's got to be good. But I'm yeah, I'm glad it's very comfortable and very clean, very impeccable. All the amenities and where they are, and it's like very Japanese that I already yeah. feel this Japanese hospitality without actually even meeting the owner it's weird Good. but yeah i feel like i'm in japan <laughs> nice i mean as long as you're settled in you know and knock out that in quarantine then you can go see your family and hopefully i can be there in a month as well mm. or two we honestly don't know that's still the craziest part right we don't really know mm -mm. when we can see each other again but I'm sure you miss me more because you're in the same house just without me and without my food. So yeah, it's I feel harder like a for you. Kid, you know, I can't even watch the shows we were watching because I'm not that interested anymore. <laughs> you know, mm. so but it's all right. It's 
cold here, but I mean, it's cold there anyway, so it's not like you gotta change up the climate or anything. Yeah. I saw the, um, the video of one of your brothers posted on our group chat. Snowy like crazy. Yeah, it snowed hard. It snowed, it was crazy, and it started when I was outside, so I'm like, wait, what the hell is going on here? <laughs> you know? But it all melted before anything. But it was it was mm. cool. It was a cool experience. If it's going to be cold, I'd rather it at least snow. So mm. there's a change in the scenery and not just cold. You know? mm -hmm. Well, I have to get some things done. So, But I love you. I'm glad to know that you're you're safe and sound in your place. Yeah. I and I'll talk too. to you later, my beautiful wife. I'll miss you, my husband. Mm. Love you, baby. I love you too. Bye, babe. Bye. All right. First thing first, but I need to cook something that can be preserved for at least a week. The radish leaf. Usually, radish leaves are thrown away, so it's very cheap. So excited to eat this. This is my first proper home cooking Japanese meal. Mm. Very simple, only three ingredients. Super easy to make. Very healthy. Mmm. It's so good. Happy birthday to me. So I wanted to show you guys some real Japanese stuff that is probably weird for you. So this is just raw egg. I'll make a little in the middle and crack this egg in the middle and put a little bit of soy sauce and mix together. A little bit more. I don't know if you can do this in any countries, which I don't do it. I don't usually do it in another country unless I can see how the chickens are grown, like free range or very happily grown, then yeah, I do that. Mm, 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 mm. So good. Okay, another thing I wanted to show you guys is this called natto. It comes with a little sauce. And basically, this is a fermented soybeans. And this slimy stuff, this is what is very healthy. You need a little technique to get this off from your plate. 
Okay. Packet of sauce. This is basically mixture of the broth and soy sauce mixed together. And what you do is mix them together and create even more the slimy stuff. If you don't grow up with it, it's going to be hard for you to get used to it. Many foreigners cannot eat natto. Mm. <laughs> Very simple, but this is what I miss and this is what I want to eat when I come back to Japan. This is how you have to get rid of your strings. Hi ninjas. This is day three. I have noticed something that I wanted to show you guys. I wanted to take my rubbish out. And here it says garbage bag. And I found there are three different kinds of garbage bags. Burnable garbage. Narita City. And every city has different regulations, so I guess the, the, the bag has to be different. You have to buy the different kinds of ba bags every time you move around. You can't use for one. This is the pet bottles. And the red one is for glass bottles and aluminum cans. The pity thing is, I'm not going to be able to fill all of this but I want to throw away. But it's such a waste and I'm sure you have to buy. It's not provided for free. So you have to buy this bag and I won't even be able to fill it, but I have to take it out with this bag. That's such a waste. <sighs> Good morning, ninjas. This is my quarantine day. Five. Okay, the sun's out, but damn, freezing. I have a news. So last night, I got an email from Ministry of Health saying that somebody who was sitting near me in the aircraft apparently had an Omicron, and they're asking me to quarantine somewhere else uh they don't tell me where i'm going they don't tell me how long it's going to be they don't tell me what's going to happen to this place that i've already paid for and if i miss the flight on the checkout day i'm supposed to fly back to my parents house so who's gonna pay for it and i also told them that I have multiple food allergies, so I cook every day at home. And what happens during that quarantine in the hotel? I do know that they're going to be providing bento boxes, three meals a day. But the additives and preservatives that I'm, I'm going to have allergic reactions to. So I told them that I haven't received the reply yet. They can't call me because I don't have SIM card in Japan. So they're going to have to contact me through email. Let's see what happens. But if I have to go to the quarantine facility, I'll report that as well. Stay tuned. Don't forget to like and subscribe. This is day five. So I'm packing. I'm packing because... I'm gonna move. I got an email from Ministry of Health and said, due to your allergies, food allergies, we cannot accommodate you in a hotel room. So, please stay. I get to stay here. But they're gonna bring a PCR test for next four days, every other day until I leave this room. Not this room, but the other room. 
and I'm gonna have to answer the different questionnaires and where I have been and I don't know but anyway I don't have to go I'm just happy and finally I get to move to the room that has one double bed so I'm packing I can already move but my check out time is 11 a.m. tomorrow so I think I want to keep my new room clean so I'm gonna bring over all my belongings there sleep here maybe take the last shower cook everything in brand new day tomorrow Okay, I'm gonna go for the first round. Cheers. Okay. I think that's it though. Maybe I just do this once and the rest tomorrow morning. Okay, good night. Okay, I just went upstairs to my new room and the fridge and the freezer was like this tiny bit small fridge like a mini bar and I quickly messaged the owner I'm like I can't move to this room <laughs> I have too many things in the freezer that's gonna all melt if I move to th that room tomorrow so quickly arranged that I can stay in this room until another five days and I will move to that room the last four nights of my stay of my quarantine I'll be moving to the other room so go up and get my bag and come back <laughs> it happens damn it I thought I'm gonna sleep in a clean room from tomorrow but hey I can't give up on a big fridge, if you know what I mean. So, I'm gonna go get it. So, again, good night, ninjas. <laughs> yes. Yes.